Hello everyone, welcome to Aviator News, myself Tanvi Shaharia. Our today's headlines is DGCA enhance monitoring of flying training organizations. Aviation regulator DGCA has put in place various measures to enhance the monitoring of flying training organization, including the installation of high resolution cameras in their premises to keep track of the training activities. Besides, the watchdog has directed that the flight training organization, FTOs, should monitor and record data of training flights and at least 25% of the flight data should be analyzed on a daily basis. The move also comes against the backdrop of incidents involving training flights as well as instances of certain individuals not following the authorized flight plan during training. In a circular, the Director General of Civil Aviation, DGCA, said the objectives in to enhance the oversight over flying and ground training activities of FTOs for improving the safety of operation as well as the training quality. All the FTOs should install cameras to high resolution on their premises to ensure proper visibility of flying training activities. The camera should over the apron areas, hangars, taxiways and runways, classrooms, examination rooms and areas where the flights are authorized in the flight authorization register as per the circular issued on November 22. FTOs have to ensure that the cameras are operational within 90 days. With respect to flight data monitoring in a training aircraft, DGCA said the safety manager concern should carry out flight data analysis of at least 25% of the FTOs on daily basis and maintain a record of analysis. Many planes available for flight training are equipped with a glass cockpit that should a provision for recording flight or fitted with ADS which can also monitor the path followed by the aircraft. The regulator noted that FTOs operational with planes that are not pre-equipped with glass cockpits or ADS should devise a method within 90 days for recording and monitoring the flights to check if the flight path taken by the training pilots and instructors are in accordance with the flight authorization. FTOs have been asked to install or carry equipment which automatically record at least parameters such as engine start time or stop time as feasible flight path for load and height and speed of aircraft at all times. According to regulator, FTOs should ensure the surveillance cameras are functional during flying activities and the camera's feed must be displayed in the CFI, deputy CFI and flying instructor rooms. The circular said the recording of cameras should be preserved for at least 30 days and the flight data of all the devices for a minimum of 6 months. Thank you. That's all. Good evening everyone. Myself, Noormin. Now I will announce about a job vacancy of Emirates Airways for the students of College of Aviation Technology. Security Supervisor in Dhaka. Job Purpose. The security supervisor at station shall be responsible for all security matters or issues and work as the nodal point of contact at station for the airport services manager and Emirates Group Security Headquarters on all security operational and administrative matters. Job accountabilities are manage or supervise the implementation of current aviation security policies and procedures to meet Emirates and local requirements. Lising and dealing and coordinating with CAAB, airport operators, AOC, immigration, customs, contracted security agency at station and other relevant authorities. At station, all security matters as directed by security controller and EGS or HDQ. Qualifications and experiences. Degree or honors 12 plus 3 or equivalent degree with a minimum of 5 years aviation industry exposure of which a minimum of 3 years should have been at a supervisory level in aviation or operational security. Knowledge or skills In-depth knowledge of aviation security, Annex 17 of ITAU, ITAS security regulations, extraordinary security procedures and measures in case of hijacks, accidents and bomb threats, 
Application closing date is 1st December 2022. Thank you.